Today's video will be quite unexpected for you, my dear friends. But I hope you will enjoy it and find it useful enough. It's time for the experiments! I have already prepared all the necessary stuff here. And now I'm about to create a real electrical engine to check how durable simple batteries can be. First of all, I will make a spiral made of the copper wire using double A battery. It's quite simple, isn't it? Now I will bend this tip a little to make something like a hooklet. So here's what I've got here. Now I will need a new battery. And I attach several round magnets to it. Here we go. Let's install the copper spiral on the battery and extend it to the necessary length. Excellent! The engine started functioning. So, let's make three spiral pieces. Why three, you might ask? Because we've got three contenders today. And I will organize a challenge between them to find out which is the coolest. The contenders will be running the engine and even take part in a racing challenge. Watch the video till the very end and you will find out a lot of curious stuff. Meanwhile, everything is set. Starting the engines and the challenge is beginning. In the meantime, I would like to figure out if it's possible to exchange a real battery with a simple kitchen lemon. To do that, I will need short wire pieces with alligator clips on the tips. Let's cut off a piece of copper wire and make a spiral out of it. Then I will insert the spiral into the lemon. Just like that. And next to the spiral I will stick in the zinc coated screw. The battery is all set now and it's time to check it. In order to do that I will use an LED light. Using the wires with alligator clips I will connect all this stuff together. And... Hmm, something went wrong. Perhaps the LED light is out of order? No, that's okay. Well, that means one lemon is simply not enough. I think I will take a little more material for the connectors, zinc coated screws, copper wire, and of course, lemons. While I'm getting ready for the next stage of the experiment, let's check how our contenders are doing. Alright, it seems like all the engines are still at work. Let's wait a little more. The connectors are ready. And now I have to prepare the lemons and finish connecting all the remaining things. Mm -hmm. 
So, I've got everything done. Let's check it all. Connecting. And... Oh, it works! But truly saying a little dim. This way it will be seen better. So, do you want to check the voltage? Wow, almost 3 volts! Hmm, I'm curious. If I add two more lemons, will it shine better? Oh, look! I think the light is shining brighter now. Let's measure how much the voltage changed. Wow, almost four and a half volts. That's incredible. Meanwhile, the number three contenders engine has stopped. Well, that's really unpredictable. It was rotating faster than the rest. Maybe it got broken? Let's check it. Well, it turns out the engine is all fine. And that means that the battery number 3 completely ran out of energy. Let's put it all back and continue our challenge. And in the meantime, I suggest conducting one more experiment. I will take a new battery and check if it can roll independently. And again, I will need some magnets. Wow, look at that! The battery is rolling itself! And this means I can run a battery racing challenge! Ready, steady, go! Wow, cool! This is really funny! So now it's time to make a conclusion. The contender number 3 – no changes. The contender number 2 – is still working. And the contender number 1 – fully stopped. So what, my friends? Did you like this video? How did you like the experiment? Thanks for watching and see you later!